Hi, this is Matt at AppWorks, and today I'm going to be talking about security with FileMaker Pro. So, specifically, let's go into the new um, security checkbox uh, in FileMaker Pro Advanced 18. So, if I go to Manage Security, I'll see this new interface, which I really love. And the first thing I'm going to do is click down to Advanced Settings, which gives me to the uh, Privilege Sets and Extended Privileges area. So the first thing that I strongly recommend is that you never use data entry only and read only access. So by default with FileMaker, you get these three privilege sets which cannot be edited. And so you can't really give any other finer control um, other than what comes with them. So what we recommend, and uh, actually before I talk about um, how to fix that, let me talk about why it's a bad idea. And, the, and one of the reasons it's a bad idea is because if you have a system um, and you use something like read-only access and you think to yourself, oh, read-only access is fine because I have a set of users that all I really want them to do is be able to look at data. Well, in a lot of systems, in addition to looking at data, you might actually want uh, a record to be created in a log every single time that record is viewed. So for example, every time I go back and forth from detail to list on this sample solution, a new record is created with the date that that record was viewed. So um, uh, that would not be possible if you use that, the default um, privilege set um, called read-only access because it doesn't have the ability under any circumstances to edit data. You, you simply can't ch click on the checkbox in here to modify the privileges. So I actually recommend that you just uncheck the FileMaker box um, for those two groups, so there's no possibility that anyone can log in with those particular groups. Okay, so how do you how do you then proceed? Here's what you should do. If you want a set that's pretty much read-only, then you can duplicate that set and then start changing it. So you can call this basic access or something like that. And then start changing for what you want it to do. So first of all, you certainly need to ch click the box so that the user can get in through the FileMaker Pro client application. Secondly, you can go in and say, I want them to be able to view data in the company table, but in the FM log table, not only should they be able to view data, but they should be able to create records. Interestingly, if you click create only, but not edit, the user can create a record and set a value, but they can't edit it once it's created that very first time, which is kind of interesting. Um, and then you can also define the, the default behavior for future uh, settings. Um, once you've got this group established, you can also set far deeper privileges. So for example, if I say um, for, for um, in the company table, I can really restrict it with limited and I can have them only view certain fields. I can have them only view uh, company records if the company is in Oregon or California or something like that. I can also set field access uh, down here under field access in the bottom right and really get uh, fine-grained control here as well. I can say they can see certain things, but they can't see who the sales rep is. So they just have no access to that at all. Um, and then furthermore, I can say, yeah, I want to be able to them to be able to update certain things, like for example, a notes field, um, or maybe they can, they can, you know, um, change the company address, but they can't, uh, change the company's name or city or things like that. Well, if you can change address, you should probably be able to change city and state and zip, um, but not the company name, for example. Okay, so that's kind of the basics of that. Um, and let's, in the next video, we're gonna talk about how this actually looks. I'll have two copies of FileMaker running and we can see how these changes actually happen and how they affect the user. Uh, thanks very much for your time for basic security in FileMaker Pro 18.